Welcome back at 650. A Lawrence County student didn't think her English homework assignment would actually help her come close to winning an essay contest to name NASA's Mars rover. But it did. So NASA sends these rovers to the planet to gather data on the planet's surface and then they send it back to Earth. Well, Pepper Baker sat down with Alexandra Smith to talk about how the experience inspired her future goals. Math and science have always been the things that really were my interest. Alexandra Smith grew up moving from one small town to another, but her interests traveled out of this world. I remember sitting outside with my pop and he'd sit there and go, well, this fix needed a meteor shower. And we'd just watch the meteor showers or we'd sit outside in a lawn chair and just watch the stars and he'd point out constellations and stuff. Now she's an East Lawrence High School sophomore and her space exploration curiosities led her to research NASA. So I kind of had seen where they were like, hey, we're getting this, we're getting this rover ready and it had videos and tutorials of what it was fixing to do. Her English teacher had the class enter NASA's essay contest to name the 2020 Mars rover. I took it and I ran with it. As far as I could go, I put in a little bit of research. I made sure that I was putting the correct origin of the goddess I chose. She landed on the name Abiona, the Roman goddess of outward travel. Her essay focused upon the rover's trip to Mars because the rover can send back information from the red planet. If we can't get it to Mars, we can't, we don't learn anything. So I really thought we needed to get it out there. And I really thought Abiona Outward travel would be a really great collaboration between the two. Out of 28,000 essays across the nation, Smith's made the cut down to 155, the only semifinalist representing Georgia. She didn't make the final round, but says this experience has inspired her. It's really interested me into maybe aerospace or maybe helping build the next Mars rover. I still want to become an engineer, but maybe hopefully work for NASA one day. In Lawrence County, Pepper Baker, 13 WMAZ News. That is so right. awesome. I love that. Now, NASA will pick a name from the nine finalists sometime in early March. And then the winning student will get to see the spacecraft launch in July from Cape Canaveral Air Force Station in Florida. How awesome. It's a really cool experience. I've gotten to oh, see so you're Florida. Florida. Yeah, Florida, so. yeah, NASA. I mean, Kennedy Space Center in general is just super cool to That's see. So awesome experience, and I hope that she continues to follow that goal because yeah. that would be a rock.